What's going on, Legion? As we're like always, we got Rivers of Nile. We're back at it with them again. Uh, a home. Hey, I'm ready. Let's just get into it. Check it out. See what it's all about. Let's hope it's good. First one was incredible. Let's see what this one brings. So cool. Hell yeah, drummer guy. Hell yeah, drummer guy. That dude's killing it.
like, like I was saying, the, the vocals, not necessarily my favorite in this video. It was definitely, I liked it more over time, his singing. Dude, his feet placement bothers me. I see it in every fucking video. He's like a penguin. His feet are always like out. Bothers the shit out of me. Um, the instrumentals, dude, the fucking, the, the basses was really good. I liked them, but both the the, the guitarist and the back, or, I, uh, what the hell's the term? It's been so long. It's lead guitar and then, you know, the other, the guitarist. Those two were really good. Uh, that Donna, Donna, whatever that was, that was really good. The drummer, dude, the drummer was killing it, especially in the opening, dude. He was going insane, and there was a lot of, uh, I think, technicality throughout. Not really constant with the drummer, but he had his moments, which is really cool. They didn't really oversaturate the, uh, the song with, like, hey, our drummer's really good. Listen, you know, everybody kind of had their moment to shine. The uh, the bassist kind of had his little thing going on. The the Backup guitar, is that what it is? I, I actually can't remember. The guitarist was, he was doing his thing, which was really good. Then the little solo, which I believe was the, the lead guitar, he was pretty good. But I liked the other guy, I think, better. I, I liked what he was doing a lot, a lot more. Um, overall, it was a good song. I'd give it yeah, I'd give it a 7.5. I'd, I'd, I'd add it to the, to the playlist, probably. It, it wouldn't be something I would sit here and listen to. It'd be something I listen to like as I drive. You know, so, something like that. Something with some energy. Something as I'm going. Not so much, you know, hey, I want to sit, you know, I'm sitting here doing something. Let's listen to some music, you know. Maybe maybe not so much. Also, the guitar and the synthesizer, that, you know, the little, we were hearing the synthesizer <clears throat> part. That was really good. It reminded me of a different band. So, if you've ever heard of the band The Browning, if you want me to check out them, I'd love to check out them. I've only heard a handful of their songs. And they got a lot of music. I've been listening to, um, what the hell is it called? Uh, I'll try to, uh, I don't know if one or both songs will get claimed. I'll just, Pure Evil. This is, Amnesia and Pure Evil, good songs. This is kind of like, this is a very intense version of what they're about. There's a different CD that is uh, not so much this heavy with everything they're doing, but this is just kind of what the Browning is. And I do, I really like this kind of music. Not all the time, but they do it really well. It's just like Rivers and Isles, it's, it's kind of this stuff. So, listen to it really quick. Wait, wait till you actually have some lyrics in here. This one's very heavy with the, uh, with like this techno trap stuff. So if this is something you want me to check out also, uh, the browning, uh, let me know in the comments down below. It's definitely, I, I really like the browning a lot. They're really good. I, like I said, I've heard the, the majority of like, I think a CD, not so much. And it's been a while and you know, I definitely recheck them out. If that's something you're into, you know, let me know and I'll definitely check them out if you've heard of them. If you haven't and you're like, that sounded kind of crazy. That was very like. I don't want to say edm -y, but maybe kind of edm -y trap. Not really even trap, more of a ED. I guess it's just EDM, not really a mix, I guess. Um, I don't even know if I could really abbrevi uh, hyphenate with something else. But um, that was very heavy on the, the lack of vocals. And, and you got to hear a little bit of the band in there. There was very heavy band, uh, instrumental with the kind of... Um, I, uh, not techno, I forgot what I said. It's not not trap, not house. Um, but yeah, I, literally the word is just out of my, I can't think of it. But that was very heavy on that, you know, on the EDM side of things. Uh, there are other songs that are way more like what we just listened to with a little bit of that EDM in there. It's a really crazy mix and I really like it. It's just really high energy. So if that sounded kind of cool and you want to check out all that versions of things, let me know, hey, check it out. If you have a specific song you want me to check out from them, link that. If you want me to check out more Rivers of Nile, link them as well, and I'll get to them as well. So with that being said, thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out. So whatever video I'm doing next, later, guys.